So the other day I was at Finish Line Performance uh, having uh, Dan Bills put a tune-up on our tow rig and I grabbed this brochure and it reminded me that this show is coming up again and I, I feel compelled to tell people about it because this is awesome. It's the Muscle Car and Corvette Nationals which is a car show that is going to happen November 20th and 21st at the Donald Stevens Convention Center in Rosemont, Illinois, right outside Chicago, right next to O'Hare. And, and why this show is so awesome is it's not your run-of-the-mill muscle car show. I mean, this is a show that, for all intents and purposes, is probably the only one of its kind in the world. And, and what I mean by that is, you know, you can go to any local car cruise and see Camaros and Chevelles and Mustangs and, and you know, Mopar and AMC muscle cars. But what the guys at the McCacken show, as they call it, MCACN, what they have done is gathered up um, the pinnacle of all the muscle cars and Corvettes, and they've got them in one 400,000 square foot building. And we're talking the, the cream of the crop, the, the Yanko Chevrolet cars, the Baldwin Motion garage cars, the Nicky Chevrolet cars, uh, the Mr. Norm's Dodge cars, Shelby cars, um, some of the top flight AMC cars, cars from Hearst. The rarest of the rare are going to be there. Um, to give you an idea, if you know about Camaros, the 69 ZL1 Camaro is supposed to be the most badass car. Big block, aluminum, you know, it's like a unicorn. There's going to be three of them there, you know. They're going to have uh, a special tribute to the class of 1970. This is the 40th year anniversary of 1970, and 1970 was widely regarded as, as the number one year for American muscle cars. So they're going to have two separate rings full of the baddest muscle cars you could buy in this country in 1970. You know, Hemi Cudas, big block Chevelle, four-speed LS6 cars, and the two rings, one side's going to be all hard tops, and the other ones are going to be all convertibles. And each one of those specialty dealers, like the Yanko cars and the Baldwin Motion cars, and uh, the Nikki Chicago cars uh, and, and Mr. Norm's Garage. They'll all have their own displays where you can get up close and personal with original survivors and restored versions of these super, super rare, ultra bad muscle cars. Uh, and, and they're trying to cater to everybody. In fact, the Buick guys, Buick factory authorized the production of two, um, what they call stage two Grand Sport 1970 Buick GSs, and these are basically full-on race cars, 11 to 1 compression, 7,000 RPM motors, you know, the baddest of the bad. Both of those cars are going to be there, you know, so even the fringe, you know, muscle car stuff that's not, you know, mainstream Camaro Chevelle, um, it's going to be there. They're going to have a whole AMC display called amc -a, you know, where they'll have AMXs and Javelins and, and whatever you want, it's going to be there. Shelby Snake Pit, if you're into Mustangs and Shelby Cobras, can have a lot of those there. And this show is also a rare opportunity to meet some of the people that made the whole muscle car scene happen. Uh, uh, Joel Rosen from Motion Garage will be there. Uh, uh, Norm Krauss, Mr. Norm from Mr. Norm's Garage, he'll be there. There's gonna be a whole display of, of cars of Hearst and Doc Watson behind the Hearst program and uh, Linda Vaughn, Miss Hearst Golden Shifter will be there, you can meet them. This is one of those deals where, you know, if you ever met anybody that owns, you know, like a Yanko supercar or a, a Baldwin Motion Phase 3 Camaro or something, a lot of times they don't like to take these cars out of the garage because they're, they're a piece of history. And now you're going to have hundreds of them all in the same place. And I didn't even get into the Corvettes. They're going to have all kinds of super rare Corvettes there, uh, judging for the Triple Diamond Award. So. If you're into muscle cars, you want to go to this thing. It's November 20th and 21st, the Donald Stevens Center in Rosemont, Illinois. It's right next to O'Hare. I mean, this one's worth flying into. You can fly to O'Hare, jump on the L train, you're 20 minutes away from the show because um, it's only about a mile from O'Hare Airport. And uh, you can learn more on their website at mcacn.com. Um, and we'll be there, so we'll look for you.